it's Aisha Cogborn from CoachAisha.com. And you know, I've got a lot of friends who are, are technical folks. I mean, doctors and lawyers and chemists and chemical engineers. And sometimes they look at me as the warm and fuzzy one in the group. And, and every now and then we'll get into these, these discussions. And one of them will challenge me and ask, you know, Aisha, I, I hear you talking about passion all the time and how you need to be passionate about your work. But really, what's what's the ROI on passion? Does it really have an impact on business success? And to that question, I answer a resounding yes. It is absolutely critical to business success. And here's why. Passion is that thing that will stir up the fire in people's bellies to get them to do what most people won't. It's that thing that will cause somebody to, to contribute all of their savings and their life and everything to a cause that they believe in. And you say, okay, yep, yeah, more warm and fuzzy stuff, but let me tell you this, it's also that thing that will make a chemist stay in the lab working 16 hour days, coming in on the weekend to try to solve a problem for a customer, not because they're getting paid to do it, but because they're passionate about it. They want to do it. So you want your people to be passionate about the work that they're doing. And my my phone is ringing and we're just gonna pick it up and hang it up and ignore it all right sorry I just hung up on somebody but we're just gonna keep rolling here so if I have to ask you if you're not passionate about what you're doing right now what is it gonna take to get that back and passion is so critical again because it is that fuel that, that really will push you towards authentically wanting to succeed not because of short-term incentives or fear of consequences, but because you care about it. And when you're passionate about what you're doing, the results are so much greater and your impact is so much greater. And so now this is not just about you and your happiness, but this is about the people that you're going to impact through the work that you do. And that's why you have to get your passion back. So if you are finding that it's a little harder to get up in the morning and you know, when five o'clock hits, you're peeling out of the parking lot as soon as you can and you just don't feel it anymore, I want you to ask yourself a couple of questions First of all, I want you to think back on the last time when you were passionate about your work. What was different about what you were doing then to the situation that you're in right now? The second question I want you to ask yourself, and this is important, how can you get that back? Maybe it's volunteering for an assignment that will bring some of those elements back into your work again that may not exist anymore. But for many people, you may have to look for that passion outside of your core responsibilities. Maybe it's volunteering. Or for a lot of people, they're starting up businesses on the side. And I've helped lots of people do this where they're able to spend their free time engaged in activity that they absolutely love, that they're passionate about and make money at the same time. How's that? And it's not about the money, but what you're passionate about has value to others too. So why not give out that value and in return, be able to, to use that monetary contribution back to you in other ways that you love. There's nothing wrong with making money doing what you love. I truly believe that that's the way that things are supposed to be. So I just wanna challenge you because again, this is not just about your happiness. When you operate with passion, the results of what you do are going to be so much greater and people are going to benefit from that. Somebody is looking to benefit from what you bring to the table. And so if you are not delivering that, you're not living up to your responsibilities. So you owe it not just to yourself, but to the, those that you have been called to serve, to live and to work with passion. So I challenge you to do that this week. If you've enjoyed this video, be sure to share it with everybody in your network and be sure to check out the website coachaisha.com. We're always putting new resources out there to help you connect your purpose and your passion with your profession. And so until next time, 